Hey everybody and welcome to the next Three Ways in Flame. Now this one's going to be on Three Ways in Flame to composite. Now this is very important and uh, really uh, has a lot of use cases so let's um, let's dive right in. So the first one is from the tools menu um, is an old school way again and we have composite and comp so it prompts us for the front, our back and our mat and then we can render here and you see it does a comp again we don't uh, want to always use this way, but it does exist, um, you know, to each their own. Now, the second way, if I go to timeline and open this red clip, um, let's say we want to comp from the timeline. So these are elements. So again, this is our front. So I'm just going to drop that on top and you see straight away, we get an option to add a mat and I'm just going to press pick mat. And now you see we've got a comp, um, albeit the pre mult was wrong, but you see, that's the second way, which is uh, handy from timeline. Um, also, uh, remember, you can always promote this um, to batch if you wanted to have this live in batch um, just by doing that. And you see it creates a comp with, albeit not the way you might lay it out. Now, onto a third way, there's actually a, there, there's a plethora of ways you could go. So first way is um, just using the regular comp. So again, um, the front, the back and then our mat and you see we get our comp we have our pre mold options and most importantly we have our blend mode options um, second way is um, a way that some people prefer to which is blend in comps so front and then mat and then it has an option for a second front but we'll just go to back and you see we get the same result um, this guy again has um, color correcting things you can have and a lot more tweaking you can do um, to your node um, personally I prefer uh, less is more and if I'm doing that to be in a separate node now the third way um, or inside a batch that is which is the obvious is if we add um, This guy and that guy and make this the back is we can do our comping inside of action um, And again, uh, we have all our blend modes like you'd expect our pre mult options again It depends if you want uh, your comp to live in 3d or not. So that's the third way in action and now another way is um it's the um, MD, it's a uh, logic ops. So this guy is handy really, because um, if you look at the blend modes we have, it's really handy just for combining mats. So if I just quickly press P, I'm just gonna paint um, a quick bit of rubbish. And then I'm gonna combine this with um, my text mat. So I'm just gonna look and you see it's just a really quick and easy way to either add, multiply, subtract, or divide. So all this, you know, the tasks you usually do um, that sometimes don't require um, this many inputs, you know, sometimes you just want a quick and um, dirty method. Now, another way is uh, another plugin that's on the logic matchbox, which is Y comp, which is cool because um, you have options to tell it what your color space is. So you, uh, if you're working in linear, um, you just don't have to worry about adding LUTs and stuff like that. So again, it input one and back and the mat. And you see, again, we, um, this one's more just for A over B though. That's the main thing to remember is um, this one, we don't have blend modes, but we do have other things that um, can speed up your workflow. So that's it for this uh, Three Ways in Flame guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed it, stay tuned for more.